I paid in full, man. Only one kick, really? That's all I need. What do you, know you want? You know you late again, bitch. I told you it was it was a slow month. I'm sorry. Sorry. Right. You know how big rich like you when you late? On your knees. You know what time it is. You know I like this shit. It's the vent. You know how big rich like it when you wake. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Mr. Banks, got your camera? No teeth. Mm. Mm. You done snapped today, Ginger. <laughs> I know you're the best in town. Oh, I know it. Ginger snaps. We better get you dressed. You got business to take care of. Hey, you gotta try this shit, Mr. Banks. I don't wanna see that, man. Where's my kiss? Oh, now you annoy me, huh? Mm. Mm. Hello, where's my kiss? I've been sitting here staring at you guys like I'm probably some kind of pervert or something. And I've been messed up on this set since day one. Maybe next time, Mr. Banks. I guess it's better than nothing then. Later, boys. That's some good shit right there. Hey, really? when you see that bitch Selena, you kill her ass, all right? I can't have no bitch ruining my business. She's stealing money from me, I know it. Shoot, she the best in town. She gotta be hiding money on me. You see that bitch, you kill her. Not a problem. I'll make sure I find her. Shit. Selena? Selena? <laughs> Selena's dead, honey. Selena is a name for the hookers. And you can call me Catwoman. And I've been a bad kitty. I don't like this Rover Rosa shit. You're late, Big Rich. Or should I say. Little dick. And you know what happens when you're late, don't you? Hmm. Selena, you know you like that shit, bitch. You know you liked it. Get on your knees. Selena, look, listen. Just the way you like it. Selena, Selena, look, listen, listen, listen. Open what? your mouth. Selena, look, just open can... your mouth. The reports are pouring in over the capture of the Joker. However, topping the news is the search of the Batman, who is wanted for the murder of five civilians and the death of DA Harvey Dent. If anyone has any information,
regarding the whereabouts of the bathroom. Oh, the crime rate has increased Dying. even more it's since the absence of Batman, me. who we all know is a wanted fugitive for the murder of Harvey Dent. Need him alive now. And doctors need him for an experiment. Hopefully this will be the day that Bane dies. This is Tracy with Gotham City News. And what is this experiment, Dr. Powell? It's the one that creates your super soldiers, gentlemen. I know that. But is this going to work this time? Well, he does has unique properties, unlike any of the other ones, yeah? He is stronger, and he has survived longer than all of the other ones, yeah? How fascinating. That is a good sign, General. It means experiment will properly work, yeah? What's in the syringe, Doctor? <laughs> it's what you create your super soldiers, General. Venom. It was created by the great Victor Freeze, oh yeah? Hmm. And he also created the mask which is on his face. You see, General, the one thing you need to understand about Venom is that it's wonderful and terrible. Yes, it does make you super strong and super fast and creates your super soldier. But it also has terrible effects. The venom creates excruciating pain. Pain that you couldn't even possibly fathom in your worst nightmares. The mask un keeps the pain at bay. If the mask is removed, pain will die. A slow and painful death. And there goes your super soldier. And this venom. Is this what killed all the others? Yeah. <laughs> so he dies after all. He's no longer the bane of this prison. In my life. Yeah, it is disappointing. Yeah? Um had much potential. I'll find another for you to experiment on. There's plenty of trash to take out here. Venom, created by Victor Freeze. How much of it do you have? Not much, but it doesn't matter. One mask, it regenerates Venom into your system. You will always have it. And if you don't take it, you will die a slow, painful death. So stay with it. You were my best patient.
Una truly unique. But we've got to talk, Mr. Reese. Who are you? Tell the hooker to leave. Get out of here, bitch. Yeah, no problem. You have some information that I want. What's that? Oh, something really. Maybe I can help. Mm. Well, every Friday night, a group of guys get together and make dirty deals. Turns me on. <sighs> mm. No, uh, no, I, I, I don't know what you're talking about. Sure. Okay, okay. Hold on. Wait. What's in the package? Huh? Something big. Uh mm -hmm. I uh, uh. Detective Flash. Hell no. He... He runs the operations. Thanks, darling. That was hot. During his captivity, the Joker has been going through numerous testing by accredited Gotham City doctors, as well as being questioned by Gotham City police for his involvement with the Batman and the attempted assassination of the entire city of Gotham. No reports have been found regarding the outcome of the questioning and the testing, but please stay tuned as we will do our very best to keep you informed. This is Tracy with Gotham City News. I'm Detective Kimball. Let's get to it. Uh, 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 oh, oh, yeah. mm. And I thought my jokes were bad. Hey, hey, I am doing the talking right here. You just tell me what I need to know and you can go back to your joke to rot, understand? Okay. Killed six officials. Three of them were cops. One of them being Harvey Dent. Was he working for you? Who? Don't play games with me, damn it. You know who? The Batman. Was he working no. for you? No. Of course not. Bullshit! If he did, he would have made my life a lot easier. 
Let's try this again. Maybe you understand. If Batman didn't kill these people, including Harvey Dent, then who did? Harvey. Yes, Harvey and five others. No, just Harvey. What are you talking about? What are you saying? You son of a bitch. You played good to me again. Uh, of course not, officer. Scout's honor. <laughs> who killed Harvey Dent? What's Commissioner Gordon doing these days? I'm sure it's very difficult to wake up every morning with guilt and fear. What are you talking about? Oh, oh, we all have our dirty little secrets. Don't we, Detective Kimball? Tell me what I need to know, that's all. Mm, I will. You don't do that, you bastard! You the freak beat my nose! Took away your privileges and all that crap you are on your face. Keep it up. We'll see what else we can take away from you. You will give me answers tonight. Look, uh, about last time. I'm sorry. You're right. Just your nose. I couldn't help stare at the entire time. Look, I just want to know more about Batman and the murder of Harvey Dent. That's it. Batman. <clears throat> Batman, uh, well, he runs around at night. He's dressed in black. Continue playing games, and me and you are finished right here. Oh, you. A lot funnier than I thought. And you are more dumb than me. Wait. <clears throat> Batman. He drives a tank. Uh, waiting his call from his lover, Commissioner Gordon. You're crazy. Those two then go and have coffee, have a couple donuts, and talk about all the detailed sprinkles. Well then, since you're not going to cooperate with us, we have a doctor of the will. Do I have to turn my head and go on? Yeah, you might like it. She's a good doctor. You try anything and you're dead. Come on in, doctor.
¿Quién carajo tú eres?
crazy gut. So I go home to my wife, and she sees me, and she is terrified of me, and she panics, leaves. What does it mean by all that? Exactly what he said, Detective Kimball. Um, what do you mean? What happened to his so-called wife? Did he really kill her? You think he's making up the story? Well, you know, there has been a reports of different stories how he got those cars. No one really knows how he got them. Except for him. You think he's telling the truth? Huh? Do you really think so? I think you're missing the meaning of what he's really saying, Detective Kimball. You know what? She killed herself, along with the unborn child. And the Joker, he wanted to die with her at the same time as some form of love, to die together. That's what he meant by it was too late. She died before he could do anything about it. You think he's telling the truth? Crane, don't you got some place to go tonight? I need to make sure our deal is still operational. I don't want any surprises like uh, last time. I, to I told you. I got you covered. It's going to be all right. That Batman, he's in his little cave hiding. All right, it's going to be no problems for your sake. Let's hope so. <laughs> <laughs>
This just in, the Joker, who has been kept at Arkham Asylum, has escaped with the help of his doctor, Harleen Quinzel. No report just yet as to their whereabouts, but the two are considered highly dangerous. Ten officials have been brutally murdered during their escape from Arkham Asylum. This is Tracy of Gotham City News. supposed to know? You're a dirty cop, Flares. Don't make me hurt you for information. Look, 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 look. I, I don't know where the Joker is, but there's something you should know. I'm listening. Jonathan Crane. Scarecrow. He's worked with a new crew of assassins. Where can I find Crane? Some lady in a cat suit. She's part of their crew. She's working with some guy in charge named Bane. You think you're bad. You should hear about Bane. They say he was born in prison. He had to fight his way out. Then he joined up with a bunch of assassins. But soon, they tried to take him out because he was going against the code. But, he got out and on his own. I heard he wore a breathing mask from his injuries. And he injected himself with something that made him stronger than before. And now he doesn't even need to wear the mask. What assassins? I don't know, I think it's the same assassins from before, from Narrows. Impossible. Look, 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 look. I'm telling you everything I know. But they got Crane working on another plan to take out Gotham. They're gonna come after you. Then tell them I'm ready. You tell them yourself. I know where the cat lady is.
I've never played with anyone before. Is it a game? <laughs> yes, it is. I'll play that. This just in, a war has begun in the streets of Gotham. People are screaming and running for their lives as a series of bombs have been released across Gotham. Reports state that these bombs have released a poisonous gas into the air. The police are doing everything they possibly can to fight back, but in the meantime, we advise you to please seek some shelter and some form of breathing mask. That way. Out there. This is with Dr. Sanders. It's a freeze. Yes, yeah, Dr. Phil. See what you can do. Gotham is under attack. Well, we don't have much time, do we? I still don't think this is a good idea. If you were in my shoes, God forbid us so, you would do anything necessary to save your wife's life. Freeze. I know you feel that what happened to your wife was unfair. It is unfair. She's perfect. She's done nothing wrong in her life to deserve this pain. Now, we carry on with our plans. Gotham is overrun to madmen. Don't lose faith and hope, Doctor. No, I have. Now, we continue on with our plan. We head to Gotham straight to Wayne Enterprises. And we take all the money we need, not only for the procedure, to find a cure for my wife and everyone with this disease. God help me if someone gets in my way. We'll make them regret it with their lives. Everything go according to plan. Mm -hmm. They didn't even see it coming. Kind of showing their surveillance. How did he do? <laughs> you should have seen it. He did everything you asked him to, story included. I like how they think it's me, but really it's not. I mean, they don't really know who the real Joker is behind the makeup. I played it off very well, too. Poor little Harley and Quinzel, turned mad by the Joker. <laughs> oh, they didn't know I was already mad, and they've only captured a double. We're all clowns. Now they'll be looking for us again, but it'll be near impossible this time with the chaos in Gotham. Then it's time to unleash our army and let the Jack out of the box. Word on the street is they have the Batman taken care of by a man named Bane. Bane. Sounds like a freak. I like it. <laughs> but no one kills the Batman but me. We'll find this Bane. And then we'll take over Wayne Enterprises and then Gotham will be ours. <laughs> 